As an Australian plein air painter, I'm really mindful of how damaging the sun can be. So I always take precautions to cover up. I wear a hat, long sleeves and close footwear, but even so, it can be really harsh. And the other day when I went to my skin doctor, I found out that I've got quite a lot of sun damage on my hands. And that's after less than two years of plein air painting. So I looked at using some manicurist fingerless gloves, which are disposable, and they're kind of okay, but they didn't sit well with me because of the environmental factor. I've got a sewing background, so I thought, how can I solve this? So I have come up with this fingerless glove with an open palm. I've got Velcro top and bottom so that I can attach the bamboo paper towel. So the bamboo paper towel comes in sheets, which I cut up into six, and I can just Velcro that on. That bit can be thrown away, but the rest of the glove I can keep. It's made from scuba fabric, and that's pretty UV. So I think this is pretty successful, and I want to show you how I do it. These are the measurements I use to draft my pattern. You can use other measurements to suit your hand. You will also need four pieces of Velcro and two pieces of elastic. This pattern is also available as a digital download on my website workspace-fads.com.au You will need to print or draw up your pattern piece then cut out one pair of scuba. You will need four pieces of Velcro. The Velcro is 2.5 by 7 centimetres long and you will need two pieces of elastic. I've used fold over elastic and I just find that quite thin and soft but you can use any elastic that you want. For the disposable palm covers, you will need to divide a piece of your bamboo towel into six and cut that out and then that will just stick onto the Velcro, like so. When selecting your fabric, you want to choose something that is fairly thick in order to have some UV protection and I've used a soft scuba and you want to make sure that it has a good 30% stretch. So to check that, take a 10 centimeter length and just stretch it, not as far as it will go, but just sort of gently stretch it. And this will go from 10 to 13. So that means that's got 30% stretch. We're going to start by sewing the Velcro onto the top and bottom edge. When you're attaching the Velcro, make sure you start about half a centimeter in from the cut edge. It's not necessary to finish off the palm cutout because we're using a stretch scuba and it's not going to fray. Next, we're going to sew the side seam of the glove. So fold it in half with the Velcro on the outside. I'm going to overlock along this edge, but if you don't have an overlocker, you could just simply hand sew using a blanket stitch. So I'm starting from the wrist in this side and I'm going to just sew up until I reach the opening of the palm. I've reached the palm opening and I'm going to attach my elastic. So I'm going to fold that in half and I'm going to line it up with this edge of the finger part. Next, I'm going to finish off the opening. Now, I could leave that raw, but because I've overlocked it, this can fray a bit, so that just helps me secure it. And there you have it. Your sun safe plein air painting glove.